Okay, in the last tutorial I showed you how to see the single track event in RaceTap. Um, you could do that, you can go through every event and see it uh, like that if you wanted to, but uh, you know that takes a while. So we have it where you can do it a lot faster than that. Alright, so what we want to do here is we do the same basic thing we already did. We click Seed to bring up our seeding screen. And then what we can do up here under, let's say, uh, oftentimes what people want to do is they want to seed all the sprints with certain rules and all the distance rates with different rules and all the, you know, et cetera, all the relays. And so you want to select um, those events. You could go through here and you can manually check what um, events you wanted to do. Um, but what I, it's easier to do is just click on, uh, say, track events or sprint events or distance. So if we just click distance, it's going to check all of our distance events um, and filter out the rest. And, uh, and now it's d done my adaptive and all that stuff in there as well. I'm just going to do the high school ones. So it's filtered my list down, you see, and I only have these distance events. So let's say I want to do my distance events at random. Um, you see, it took away some of my options here because we're not we don't need all the fancy stuff. And rather than by lane preference, we're not really going to worry about about that too much. Um, we're going to do um, water ball, wa uh, water ball, waterfall and we can do it in whatever order we want but we're going to just seed um, uh, best to worst so that the and we want to have the best together and um, when you do a waterfall type seeding you can do a lot more um, lanes so you see we have 48 entries here um, again if we wanted to well we don't need to go through each event we're not going through each event so you want to make sure you have enough for everybody um, that's a lot to put in one so let's just do 32 per Okay. So what we want to do now, we want to seed all these rather than going through each and every single one. We want to make it automatic for us, right? So what we want to do is use the feature that we call autopilot. So we set up our rules. We're happy with it. If you, in theory, you know, you could seed this and just to see what it would do, just to make sure it did what you think it will do. Okay, so it's done two different heats like that. And uh, so. My, uh, my YouTube is about to pop up in front of me, so I'm kind of keeping my eye on it. So you can just review that and make sure that it did what you wanted to do, and if it doesn't, you can tweak that down. Let's say, oh, I don't really want 32. Let's you know, change this to 24. Um, you know, whatever you want to do, just make sure that that looks good to you. Okay? There's my YouTube. Okay. All right, so now our rules are good for us, and we want to go ahead and, and seed all these distance rates events all at once. So what we're going to do is we're going to click this autopilot button here, which is basically going to play what it's going to do. And it gives you a time period to kind of bail out of this. So if you see up here, so it seeded that first one, seeding saved. Now it's going to go on to the next event. And you see this 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That's giving us a period of, of giving you a chance to look over it and uh, make sure you're comfortable with that. And if we don't like it, we can click pause and it will stop seeding. So basically, again, give you a chance to bail out of that. You can configure in race tab what time period you want. If you want 15 seconds, you have more chance. If you want one second if you want zero. Um, so you kind of decide, but again, it gives you a chance to just make sure everything is the way you want it. Um, and I so I clicked autopilot again and it's saying, hey, we already seeded these. Do you want to continue and reseed? And I just go ahead and say yes. And again, I'm going to let it go through all those. And once it's done, it's done. All those guys are seeded for me. And that's it. And you see now my, let's go to my 1600. See it seated. That's all there is to it.